uh, stamp their land. <clears throat> That's probably my stamps, you know, left of me. And, uh, you know, I've been here all the time getting wood. And I take it back. I never waste anything. I chopped this tree down. I would have taken a trailer load from this tree, just the one tree. So it's not going to waste. Because I make, I sit down and make these things every day. My shoulder's a bit sore now, but, but I still keep going. <laughs> yeah. But uh, I love doing it. I love doing it. And I want to work with uh, Patrick. Kim's going to work with me. And, um, you know, by when we want to go out also, come out here one day, uh, make a fire and sit around in the fire and make these things, talking about it, telling stories. Uh, which would be good. So we need to do that. So what do you think will come out of these, this tree here? <coughs> well, we're going to make a lot of things out of this tree here. See, we, we'll make coolermans, we'll make boomerangs, we'll make waddies, shield, uh, the spear thrower. But uh, it's a pity that we can't get spears out of these trees. But we will make uh, nulla nulla. Uh, we just about make every those small stuff, you know. It's a pity that we can't do spears. We'll make, uh, we can't make a uh, comeback boomerang out of it. Uh, but a killer boomerang, and things like that. <coughs> Clapping stick, uh, music stick, it makes it makes a good music sound and uh, we make a lot of that out of that. Uh, um, you know, I'm trying to you know, teach kids in Port Augusta there at the primary school. I want to do it all the time because I want this to keep going uh, for a long time because otherwise we're going to lose it. Uh, not too many of us are doing it. These days, it's a pity. Yeah, that's about all I can say now. It got a bit of a flu, but I, uh, yeah, it's really good. Great, okay, Captain.